My name is Dylan Jorgensen, and welcome to my online programming course, Learn Python Like a B Student. So this is B Student. He studies the science of learning, and I brought him along because I thought together we could build a new kind of programming course. One that shortens learning time, improves retention, and keeps your life in balance. By the end of this course, you are going to be able to build dozens of Python scripts that can do amazing things like automate drinking songs, improve your love life, and even tell interactive jokes. Plus, along the way, you're going to learn the skills for a whole new career, like app development, data science, or robotics. My first area of improvement was in saving time. In fact, the biggest reason that people don't complete online courses is that they're simply too busy to finish. So you're going to learn from lessons that are recorded with pre-written code, and this eliminates that time often wasted watching the instructor type. Tutorials are professionally recorded, well edited, and built with care. This eliminates time often wasted with pauses, tangents, and distractions. Videos range in length from between 6 and 12 minutes, which is the optimal range for engagement. My second set of improvements help with knowledge retention. People retain less than 10% of a standard lecture. So this course splits the why and the how into completely different lessons. Every topic is first presented in a no-code discussion that explains what it is and why it matters. And then it's presented again in various code examples to demonstrate how it works. The why sections are even broken into a special code-free ebook that comes included in the course. This allows you to read the why of programming in an intuitive way. Humans are hardwired to remember real-life objects, so each concept we discuss is connected to a physical object that you can imagine seeing, feeling, and interacting with. We built programming concepts on top of a common association by specifying a metaphor for each mnemonic, and this lets you use already-in-place mental scaffolding to learn faster. Code examples are spiced with an obscure situational comedy, and this helps you retain the memory by way of the bizarreness effect. All the code examples we interact with throughout the entire course are free to download on GitHub. And this lets you learn by playing around, breaking the code, and then learning from those mistakes. My last area of improvement is all about balance. Now, most people acknowledge cramming doesn't work, willpower runs thin, and distractions inhibit learning, but it's hard to keep everything in balance. In this course, I gave each tutorial two numbering systems. Now, the top number shows the breadth. This is how much progress you're making across topics. And the second number shows the depth. And this is how deep into the specific topic's complexity you are. And finally, this course comes with a recommended schedule that requires consistency, but never more than 60 minutes at a time. This reduces your overall learning investment and breaks a big goal into easy to follow steps. Now, if you're ready to begin our journey, enroll in the class now and learn Python like a B student.